The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Introducing first, from Guatemala City, Guatemala, the women's. I don't know about you guys, but it seems to me like the champ is a little more relaxed champion. than we're used to seeing her. Nelson. Well, if she thinks she's got the night off just because the title's not on the line, I've got some bad news for her because the beating she will take will be anything but a vacation. And her partner from Valhalla, Alex. Guys, we have a big-time tag team match coming up here. A big-time match with big-time stakes, Michael. Neither one of these superstars can afford a loss right now. We're just moments away from this huge tag team match, guys. And I don't think I've ever seen these four superstars more motivated than they appear to be heading into this one, Michael. And her partner from Mississippi, Brittany Sears. Guys, we have two of WWE's most exciting teams ready to go here tonight in tag team action. And I can tell you that the entire tag team division has eyes on this match right now. That's how big this one is. And we're now underway with this huge tag team match. Oh, man. Harsh impact. Oh, man, what a spot. 
Splash. She's taking on some offense here. Her and her partner aren't going to let this derail them, though. She's, she might have it. She better do something fast. And she breaks free. I don't know how she did it, but that was impressive. Big elbow. What a stomp. Good grief. Up. Oh, look at that. Ooh, what impact. Over the last few years, the tag team scene in WWE is hotter than it's ever been. One of the teams that has shined brighter than any other is the New Day. Xavier Woods, Big E, and Kofi Kingston are two-time tag team champions but it was their second reign that put the New Day name in WWE history books forever. She's absorbing some offense here. Her and her partner making it a great tag team. We'll see what they're made of here. The tag team competition right now is as heated as it's ever been since the Attitude Era. Everywhere you look, there's another tremendous tag team combination looking to make a run at the WWE Tag Team Gold. When we talk about the New Day, the team won a fatal four-way match in their second tag team title reign at 2015's SummerSlam. I may think the power of positivity stinks like a bag of rotting garbage. And that Woods, Kingston, she's looking at it. For many years, members of the WWE Universe and the WWE locker room have felt that tag team matches should have two referees. One referee is in the ring overseeing the action, and the other is located out on the floor, making sure teams follow the rules and do not engage in potentially damaging behavior. I think that's a good idea, something perhaps Mr. McMahon might want to consider. Byron, earlier you raised a point that people have been talking about for years, and that's a second referee being appointed to tag team matches. I remember WWE Hall of Famer and former WWE President Gorilla Monsoon used to express his strong advocacy for two referees being appointed to tag team matches. Uh, it's something that's been talked about for decades, Michael, and I don't think it's ever going to happen. We've seen it on occasion, but I think it's best to let the superstars be responsible for themselves. And the appointed official for the match needs to do the job they're paid to do. I don't think it's that much to ask. Most of the truly great tag teams in sports entertainment created a double team finishing maneuver. Oh, the spike pile driver from Anderson and Blanchard, the heart attack from the Heart Foundation, the rocker dropper from the Rockers, or the doomsday device from the Road Warriors. A team needs to have a tag team finisher and be able to execute that finisher on all types of opponents. She wants to do this in the ring. They did it! We got our money's worth for that one. Take a look. Look at her go. And here's a last look at this one. what happens when you can't answer the 10 count hey rules are rules you got to pay attention to the 10 count or you're gonna lose it's